Next, we're going to move on to rear light. Now, rear light is fairly simple. Now, remember, the goal for lighting rear is to highlight shoulders and heads and hard edges. And we are now simply going to do this for the entire stage in our lights up and lights down scenario, and we're going to continue to use the PARS. So I've used PARS for this rear light application. And as you can see, my shoulders are not lit right now. So as we add in the PARS, you can see how the shoulders have some light on them, my head has some light onto it. Now it's adding separation from the foreground to the background. So as you can see, we now have an evenly lit stage, both from the front and the rear. Now the biggest thing to remember when lighting from the rear is you don't want the light to spill on the back wall, the set or the screens or whatever else you have upstage as it will wash out anything you're trying to achieve with projection. Or maybe set design that's lit from other options such as this wooden set that I've lit up with LED. Now that we've talked about rear lighting for our lights up and lights down scenario using PARS, I want to talk about rear lighting for zones. For zones, we want to make sure that we have a rear light for each zone. It is basically the same idea as three-point lighting for a subject, but instead we're doing it for a zone on the stage. So here we have some Fresnels with barn doors set up for rear light on stage left and stage right. I've used PARS for rear light for center stage as I want to show you the advantage of using barn doors for rear light. As you can see with the stage left and the stage right, we can control the sideways light to create a lit zone exactly where I want it. And you can almost see a square there. So as you can see where I'm standing with the PARS for rear light with no barn doors, there's some light that spills off where I may not necessarily want to cast the light. Once again, barn doors can of course go on PARS and you do not necessarily need to use a Fresnel to use a barn door.